A very good day to you people. My name is Mohit and guys today I want to talk about Arjuna Risht. But even before I do that, I, want, I have few things to say, few very important things to say regarding heart disease. See arteries take decades to close down. Nitric oxide protects the arteries but we injure it by consuming meat, eggs, dairy, fish and fowl, sweet beverages, sugar, honey, agave, desserts and coffee. And of course, even a drop of oil. See, what is the function of nitric oxide? Why is it so important? It prevents stickiness. It's a, it helps vasodilatation. Basically, it helps the arteries to expand. Avoids arterial thickening. Prevents blockages. Prevents smooth muscle migration and destroys foam cells. Too technical. In simple words, it keeps the arteries in good health and we damage it by consuming meat, eggs, dairy, fish, fowl, sweet beverages, sugar, honey, agave, desserts and coffee and of course oil. There was a study done by Dr. Asselstyn uh, in which 177 people plus 21 people participated. These 177 people complied to the diet which is a whole food plant based diet, a vegan diet and 21 did not comply. What happened to those 21 people? 62% had in the following years heart attack and stroke etc. a cardiovascular event. But what happened to those 177 that actually did comply? Only 0.6% had a heart, heart attack or stroke. Now isn't that wonderful? That means that when you go on a whole foods plant based diet ultra low in fat ultra low in nuts and zero oil your chances of preventing and reversing a cardiovascular event and all these people I'm talking about were heart patients so a future event can be reversed or prevented and the condition the heart disease can be abolished and the success rate is 98%. See, let me give you a few pearls of wisdom. Uh, one, your fat calories as they increase are directly proportional to disease and death. That's number one. So fat calories as they increase directly proportional to disease and death are directly proportional to disease and death. Second thing is, which I want to say is, that animal proteins, calories from animal proteins and animal, uh, calories from fat, both are actually directly proportional to death and disease. Okay, now uh, this is going to be part one of two. So in part two, I'll actually talk about uh, Arjuna Risht. In part one, I'm, I'm basically focusing on heart disease. So I just want to say that after a fatty meal, the FMD or the flow mediated dilatation. What is that? It is the ability of the arteries to expand or relax when needed. So when you are exercising or when you are under stress, uh, when you are doing something physical like an exercise. So you need the arteries to expand at that time. So that is affected after a fatty meal. For the next 6 to 8 hours, peaking at 4 hours. And that is also affected the flow mediated dilatation is also affected after a fatty meal. So let's say you have had hash brown potatoes with uh, uh, chicken sausages. Within 120 seconds of eating that, the flow mediated dilatation or the ability of the arteries to expand is immediately affected. So guys, I'll see you in part two with the oh, how Arjuna Risht acts like a cardiac tonic, acts like a heart tonic, uh, brings your blood pressure down, clears of the plaque, clears of the cholesterol, brings the triglycerides down, uh, systolic blood pressure down and uh, why it's so helpful for uh, heart patients. Guys, I'll see you soon and do join me in the next part. You have a good day.